Hi everybody, Chantal High, Canada's dating coach, and let's talk about fighting today in a relationship. Is it healthy to fight or is it not healthy to fight? Now, this is a debate that I get into uh, quite often because most of the time people will say, no, fighting is good and it makes us better. And I understand why they say that because the lead up to a fight is pressure. Somebody has a problem, somebody's waiting for the right time, the right place, the right words to put this problem on the table and hash it out. And what happens in the meantime is the pressure is building inside of them and because we infect each other with the vibe that's going on inside of us, our partner gets infected with that negativity that's going on, that building of the pressure. And then finally you have the conversation, you pop that bubble because usually that conversation is gonna turn into a fight because most people are gonna bring a problem and not a solution, which we'll puts their partner on the defensive, which means that there is an unhappy exchange that goes on before finally coming to a solution. And that was the fight. What is the alternative? Not fighting. Why is not fighting better? Here's the thing, men double women's emotional response when it comes to the emotion called heartwarming. It is a deep, deep emotional response. This is the emotion that makes them work hard to ensure the survival of the child that they create. It is such a strong feeling in them, far more than we can understand as women. So what happens during a fight? Well, there's anger and anger is a byproduct of hurt. And what do we do when we're hurt? We pull our feelings in. Then we have the discussion, we find a solution, we make up, out come the feelings again. But then what happens is the next fight. So in they go again, go through the same cycle, here come the feelings back and forth, but they hit a wall because the next fight happens and people go into self-protection mode. When you stop fighting, what happens to the feelings? Well, they get out to where they used to go and then the fight doesn't happen. So then they feel a little bit safe. So the feelings come out a little bit more next fight doesn't happen so they feel a little bit safer and now they open up their feelings even more and so what happens is a growth of love because there is an increase in the feeling of safety so when you make your relationship a safe place and fighting stops happening the love hits a level that you have never experienced before and i want this for you and that is why i wrote this book right here, no, or sorry, not wrong one, fix that shit. This is, this is no more asshole. This is how you find the one that you're gonna learn how to stop fighting with. So if you're in a relationship and there's fighting and you wanna get to zero fights, you want to go wherever you buy books online, Amazon, Barnes and Noble, you name it, go find a copy of Fix That Shit, read it. If you're telling me you don't have time, mm -mm -mm, stick it by the toilet, my friend, because you'll read a chapter every time you sit down very short. And send me some feedback. We'll leave a review on Amazon after about the amazingness that happened in your relationship because of the changed behaviors that you exuded. I love you so much and I'll talk to you soon.